Hey, how's it going, everybody? It's Justin. Uh, thanks for checking out Exhaust State Comics. Doing a haul today for September 30th. Uh, so, new books that came out today. And if you look through any list of books or any like pre releases or anything for this week, um, like on comicbook.com, I do that list. I write that list every week. So, every Monday, um, every Monday morning, I put up the new list for books that are coming out that Wednesday. So, if you want to check that out, there's a link below. Um, but there just wasn't a ton of books this week, which, if if you're like me and you get a lot of books or you you feel like you get a lot of books, you kind of cherish these weeks where there just aren't that many books that, that you get that are coming out. Um, so, kind of took advantage of that. Only got the new books that I would normally get. Didn't get any back issues or anything like that. Um, I did get bags and boards because <sighs> bags and boards you always need them. You always run out inopportune times it doesn't help when you do like my ebay haul where i got like 50 something books so yeah how many of that well remember i got like six or seven of the same issue so that was awesome uh but we got a cool bag this week we finally got off the gotham and now we're on the supergirl all right with big bang theory on the back so. whatever hey made it to the pile all right all right all right all right, comic shop news is slab. Slab. Not sure what this is. The doctor's in. There's another picture on the back too. So it's crazy. I don't know if you can tell, but the guys are like zombies or something. So Oops. I don't know if I'll check that out. Maybe, maybe. Maybe not. So, I only got a few books this week. Like I said, it was a light week. Take advantage of those when you get them. Um, so, you know, only get the things you really want, you know. I thought about, like, trying a few other titles out, but I was like, nope. I'm just going to stick to what I got and enjoy a short week and maybe actually get caught up on a ton of books that I've kind of put to the side. So, all right, we'll just start off. These are kind of mixed up. First is... Justice League 44, The Dark Side War Part 4. Um, this has been awesome. I've really, really enjoyed this story. If you just want a good DC book with all of the characters that you like, kind of, I think Justice League's the best. You actually have Batman uh, as Bruce Wayne, and you have Superman with his full power, and it's normal. Mr. Miracle is cool. Like, it's a good book. What, you know... It, it takes a good story to make Mr. Miracle kind of cool. Unless you're just a huge fan of him. Like, he was good in the cartoon. But he hasn't really been that awesome in the books to me. But, like I said, this was really good. Um, let me show you something, maybe. I haven't even looked through here to see what's going on. Other than I just flipped through as I was looking at it here. Uh, wow, there's ads. So many ads. Alright, well, there's a big, like, spread. So that's cool. Got Dark Side and uh, the Anti Monitor going at it. So, yeah. So Jeff Jones and uh, Jason Faybuck. Faybuck, I believe. Yeah. So, look good. All right. I did pick up a new book this week. Uh, this is from Image. And I just saw it. Wanted to kind of check it out and just see what it was about. Um, it is. What is it? It is. From Under the Mountains. This is issue number one. And let's see. Claire Gibson did the story and the script. And the art is Salone Leon. Lone? I don't know. Blog? But let's see. I don't know. I have no clue what this book's about. But it just kind of looked interesting. I don't know if it's like, uh, like a Persian story from back in the day over there or what. But, um, you know, some pretty cool art, so I'll check it out, see what it's about. Uh, if you know what it's about, or if you've already read it, and you like it, or don't like it, let me know! I don't know. Looks like there's a lot of dialogue, so we'll see what's going on. Apparently, I'm just going to look through this whole book. Alright, I'll put it down. Whatever. I don't know, it looks interesting, but I have no clue. I don't know, like I said, Persian, maybe? I could be wrong. Alright, next. Inferno, issue number five. Yes, 
So this should be... Yep, the last issue. I didn't see it, I just saw the mark. So the last issue of Inferno. It's wrapping up this story. Which I... It's the next title, so I wanted to read it through. See where it went. Um, trying to find you something good to look at. Oh, well, there's some good stuff. Got Domino and Colossus up there. So I don't know. It's been good. Kind of interested to see. Oh, we got a cool Daredevil. Something. Oh, it's like pizza. No, nope. super weak for New York Comic Con, which I guess is next weekend. Yeah, I guess. I will not be going. There's some more. We're just going to show you some more stuff. Because that's why, why not? Why not, right? All right, next. X-Men 92, issue number four. And this is the last issue of this one. But it was announced, though, that we are getting a ongoing series post-Secret Wars of X-Men 92. So that'll be interesting to see where they go. I mean, are they going to be on their own world? So we're definitely going to have a multiverse? Like, I don't know. I don't, I don't know, but that's cool, I mean, I'll pick it up, at least the first few issues and see how that story goes. Alright, last, the last book I got this week, Superman issue 44, uh, still going with this storyline of him being weak and everything, so this is a Before Truth part 4, was it always Before Truth? I don't think it was. Um, I don't know. This has been a good. It's it's such a different Superman story with him being depowered. Um, maybe he's not anymore. But it's such a different story that I've kind of stuck with it just to see how it plays out. Um, I would like Superman to be normal again because the solar flare ability is ridiculous. Like he'll use it, and he's still not even powered up, so he just drains himself all over again. I don't know. Seems like a bad ability that you wouldn't want to use. But it is what it is. So, Alright. That's pretty much the haul, I guess, for this week. Keep it kind of short. Um, we'll be on Twitch tonight with Happy Boxing. There will be a link in the description below. Or follow me on Twitter and I'll tweet that out as soon as we go live. Um, it should be at about 8pm to 10, 10.30pm Eastern Standard Time in the U.S. And we'll be on there talking about comics. Uh, not sure what game he'll be playing tonight. Maybe Mad Max. So check that out. Also check out comicbook.com's YouTube YouTube channel. Link in the description below for two comic book dudes. Uh, it's Aaron Clutter and myself. We do a show over there where we talk about the Xenoscope books uh, and the Valiant books, and we also do a kind of new comic book day spectacular over there also. So, all right. But uh, I think that's it for this week. Uh, I really appreciate everybody, you know, subscribing and watching these videos. Um, just made it over 50 subscribers on this channel, so I really appreciate that. That means a lot to me, um, and I will keep trying to put out some better, more entertaining and informative. Yes, we're going to go informative on some people soon. Um, so we'll be coming out with some new videos soon. So thanks a lot for watching, everybody. Have a good one, and let me know in the comments below what you're reading this week. It was a light week for me, so... What'd you pick up? Thanks.